Why is it that you never really know what you have until it's gone? We've been dealt with one hell of a reminder of that fact and know how the world has changed. We've all changed. I as an artist and a person have changed. During this distorted time, all of us across the planet have faced a collective fear, sometimes loss, social and emotional isolation, and a realization of how little control we really have over our own universe. But we've also discovered how big we really are. We remember it is never these adverse moments that define us. We define us in these adverse moments. We're rising up and the world is overcoming. Business is carrying on with customer distancing, outdoor activities and virtual meetings, entertainment and even events. Companies sharing information and technologies and discoveries at warp speed, entrepreneurs and global industry have repurposed their production capacity to meet this fight head on. Communities and countries have picked up the flag and joined this global fight against this tiny, little tiny molecular enemy that's impacted us all. We are in this together and it is the state of unity where the human spirit has found and will continue to find its cardinal calling. Humanity is so much bigger than the sum of its parts. And in this moment, it's reminded me once again that wildlife and wild places really do matter. They matter to us as hunters, they matter to us as individuals, human beings and society at large. Remember that just being in the outdoors, it replenishes our mind, lifts our spirits, renews our passion for living. We'll look back on this someday, in this challenging moment, and be reminded of how we were solid in our foundation and unbreakable in our resolve. We still have many more life stories to play out, campfires and stories to be told around the campfires. And we must remember that our best is yet to come. I'm ready to plan those activities. I'm ready to make a difference in conservation. And I want to meet with my friends and family at the greatest hunting convention on earth, the 39th annual Dallas Safari Club convention. And I certainly hope to see you there.